finished taping our very important show now, so. Are we both then, in? Yeah. Just to make sure this is all even. <clears throat> this is the hangover edition, so I'm gonna wear my shades. I've already put my zine in and done enough coke today that I could just get through it. Anyway. You see, we're just two girls in this world in Hollywood trying to get our dreams made. We're trying to get our movie done, girl. We are giving you executive, a lesbian, a movie, a realness. But no one wants to help us, so we're fucked. Hey! Instead, we're just going to go to other people's movies and talk shit. And we'll be in... Office. It's another word for vagina. We decided today that we were going to go see a blockbuster movie. So we went to see a, a blockbuster one entitled Shit Stain Island. We're at the top of the grove in the parking lot. And we're going to go see Shit Island. Shutter Island today. Okay, she's gonna do a thing where she pretends that she's slapping you guys. I think you should double slap them. This movie is a joke! It was so bad. Please don't go see it. Whatever you do, it's horrible! to be some suspense, thriller, thriller, all about Hitchcock. Somebody should have said, hey, why don't you go see the hilarious comedy of Shutter Island? <laughs> I find all that expository kind of like setting up, setting up, setting up, setting up, setting up, setting up for the big reveal, which is just a lot of anyway, to just be boring. We knew the secret or the twist from seven and two point minutes in. Yeah. We would marry Avatar and have a hundred thousand of its babies before we would ever. We walked out of this movie too! <laughs> we again had to walk out! Uh, we left the movie again. This is so horrible. Oh, Chuck, I don't know which, what you're talking about. Hey, let's, yeah. It's cold like Shutter Island. And it was just so fucking lame. They're thinking like, are other people feeling what we're feeling? Over two hours. Over, over two hours. And we went at 10.30 in the morning, by the way. We were up all night. And then we- At a party. Freak it. Yeah, well we thought we were at the senior citizen showing because it was at the the dawn of the day. <laughs> we had like pacemakers going off <laughs> and like drinking soup meals through straws. Yeah. <laughs> However, we then realized upon viewing the movie that in fact it's made for senior <laughs> citizens who enjoy Hitchcock 50s yes. talk. Who want to go dress. back. Yep, who want to go back and, and just enjoy that whole oeuvre. <laughs> Lots of 50s slang, good to go round. Lots of like, hey boss, where are you going? You need a pack of smokes? I mean, there was some cheese. There was some fried up, melted American cheese yep. slopped on some white bread yes. and just handed to you on a silver platter with a candle in, in it. a home for old people. Well then it's like, what kind of man are you? <laughs> what kind of man are you? And I was like, oh, you know what kind of man you are? Fucking gay man. Why don't you get <laughs> off to Shutter <laughs> Island thing. and go to Gator Island? <laughs> if this movie had been called like... Fire Island and it had been on Fire <laughs> Island, it would have been fucking awesome compared to this crap. It's like, <laughs> 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 Totally, I yeah. Hey, there's a body found on the beach. <laughs> what are we gonna do? What kind of body did you find on the beach? God, Greg, you're always finding bodies on the beach. I mean, the question I that kept it, yeah. going in my head was, isn't Mark Ruffalo horrified? <laughs> from, see, from the time they were like, action, he was like, $10 Yep. <laughs> exactly. Hey boss, what do you know? And who wouldn't do that? I would do it. You'd be in there. Boss! Mike Scorsese said, I need you to do this part. You're gonna be a lesbian in the 50s. One million dollars. Even a hundred thousand dollars. Even if going fifty thousand dollars. Seven hundred and fifty dollars, I'm fucking doing it. Oh, and everyone was doing their best 
crazy acting. Oh, crazy acting. Like, they were all, so everybody had to pull out all Ugh. their tricks. You gotta be crazy. Crazy people love to move around. <laughs> and they're always hurt or rocking. And crazy people also either yell at you or they speak in a whisper. Michelle Williams was made us want to poke our own eyes out with like I wanted to get a pen out of my purse pull it out and poke my own eyes out and then poke Julie's out I love a good like mental institution movie it looks scary it looks scary but it was mm -mm. not scary give you a briefing about the institution hey boss hey feeling all right I'm seasick from this boat. From Boston, but I can't. I don't have a Boston accent, really. Oh. Well, I'm feeling sick. I, I wicked need a cigarette. <laughs> Did that light? <laughs> Here. I'm fake smoking. Okay. <laughs> yep. You know they say. What? Well, how'd you even get assigned to this job anyway? And there's a missing oh. lady, Rachel Solando. Yeah, so there's only one way off this island, and there's only one way on, and it's a ferry. Welcome to Shutter Island. I want Shutter Island with police. You are hereby required to surrender your firearms. And all of your clothes. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> we take only the most dangerous and damaged patients, ones no other hospital can manage. What the fuck are you doing here? Nobody wants you here, weirdo. What did happen to Rachel Solando? Everyone's wondering. She was in her cell at 10 o'clock at night. The doors were locked from the inside and the outside. There were no windows. Walls were very walled in. It's as if she evaporated straight through the walls. And you may find yourself maybe having some dreams, maybe having some hallucinations. Honey? Job. Can I turn the light on? Is that okay with everybody? Turn the light on. Terry, let me go. I can't let you go. I love you too much. I feel uncomfortable with you touching my stomach. Go. Oh, oh. It's crazy! It's crazy! <laughs> the crazies are everywhere. This is... You're the real Rachel Solando, aren't you? What's behind your back? Fine. But I'm not giving this up. <laughs> I took it from the cafeteria. Are you gonna stab me with it? No, I use it to eat. I have a, kni a knife and a spoon, too. Everyone on this fucking island is trying to turn me crazy, and I can't get the ferry, and I can't get off this island. Never gonna get on that ferry. You're never gonna get off this island. Can I stay in your cave? No, you cannot stay in my cave. I can't even stay in my cave. I have to go to a different cave, different parts of the day. And how are you supposed to... Keep eluding them. They're eventually they're gonna find you. At two o'clock, I'm at the in the tiny cave. At three o'clock, I'm in the big cave. At four o'clock, I'm by the water. And by six p.m., I'm by the seaweed with the ruffles. You better do the same, because you're gonna be here, and they're gonna try and kill you and suck out your brain through a translobial psychotic nerve drive. Yeah, it seems like they're doing lobotomies. Going somewhere? I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go back to Boston. I wanna like watch some TV and hang out. So. We'll see you later, okay? You'll never leave this island. This week on In Your Box Office, we give Shutter Island... Nothing. Me, I'm gonna say nothing, em too. Empty Box, empty again. Box again. I'm gonna go so far as to say Empty Box being filled with stool. I'm putting shit in my box. I think my well, box was raped. Sorry, Shutter Island. Hated it. Hated it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we think of your Shutter Bucket Island. And I am honored to have worked with you, Marty. It's Scorsese, too. It's supposed Marty? to be Scorsese. Oh, it's, it's supposed to be Scorsese? <laughs> well, then I'm going to call him Martin Scorsese. <laughs> Martin Scorsese. Now I'm going to open the mouth at the end. Scorsese. We're calling him Martin. 
Yeah, fuck it. Mm. 